Holy Jesus. What is that? What the f*** is that? What is that private pile? Hey everyone, Thornton Smash here, and Season 11 will be going live in just three and a half hours or at 10 a.m. Pacific Standard Time. But today we're going to go over how to track your heirloom progress so you all know how close you are to getting the Season 11 Watson heirloom or any other one that you want. Along with that, we also have to give out 10 battle passes, so if you see your comment down below, that means you won. Just message me in the Discord link below. And we also hit 83,000 subscribers, so thank you guys so much. If you want to win the 8,300 Apex coins, just like, comment, subscribe, and I'll announce the winners tomorrow but now let's talk about heirloom progress quick heads up i have covered this information before but i try to do it every time there's a new season to allow people that are new to the channel and had no idea about this use this as a tool in the future now let's begin there is a way to actually keep track of how many packs you've opened to make this process easier you will need to go to this website and once you're on this page you can start putting in some of the information tied to your account to let yourself calculate where you're at you're going to want to put in your account level and then you're going to want to go to your battle pass and you will want to select whether you paid for the battle pass or you are using the free one and then put it in your battle pass level there's also an easy way to see what level you achieved in each battle pass you simply go to your badges on any legend that you want when you scroll down you'll see seasonal badges right here and under each one you can see which level you achieved in them as you can see i have the reactive ones but everyone's gonna have an individual one and if you didn't place in season one that's fine you just start with what you have and work your way down it will also ask you to put in how many treasure packs you completed for each season there will be a number of daily treasure packs collected there's only 60 total available that you can put in here but if you've collected every single treasure pack for a season you can just put 60 and if you're not sure how many you did check your gun charms because that will be able to tell you how far you made it every season the quests give you different charms but they also give you apex packs which is why it's important to count them as you can see the quest charms are cataloged on apex legends fandom so you, all you have to do is just check to see which ones you've obtained and then that should tell you if you got all 60 packs or where you stopped off and then you can go ahead and have that calculation be correct once you put in all your battle pass and your packs from your quest in you can go down to the bottom and you'll see how many packs you've purchased you'll want to check your receipt for either card or whatever it is that you used to purchase them and that should tell you how many you have bought through that method and then there's also bugs and miscellaneous sometimes you'll get an extra apex packs and sometimes because of mess ups in the game the devs end up giving out extra packs as a way to say sorry once you've all done that you can go ahead and hit view progress once you have done that it will give you a breakdown in graph form of how many packs you've opened and in what method you have done so you can scroll down and you will see an heirloom progress report and how many treasure packs you can miss before you have to catch up so that's going to be today's video guys i hope it helps you figure out your progress towards your season 11 heirloom and i hope you all have a blast playing season 11 i'll be live streaming it when it drops and for every win we get on youtube live stream i'll give out 1000 apex points to swing by and try to win some coins and until next time legends keep slaying in the outlands i'll see you out there it's cold i'm going home